Hi, I'm Chris Mowry, Creative Manager at Toho International, and this is my dog, Peanut. Welcome to Godzilla Chomp. Last episode, we just scratched the surface regarding Toho International's mission with Godzilla. As you can tell, there's a number of products here spanning the many decades since Toho is in the office in Los Angeles. We showed you a bit of the office and a special toy of mine. Let's take a look at some other cool things here. One of the first things you'll see when you come into the office in the lobby, besides this amazing mural, which we will cover in a future episode, is this incredible statue. Made for Godzilla's 60th anniversary in 2014 and designed by late effects director Koichi Kawakita, the statue is an awesome tribute to the character and the Heisei era of films. It's also a replica of the bronze statue. Rumor has it now, though, that there's an original script for 1954 film that now lies under the Shin Godzilla statue. Speaking of anniversaries, in 2004, Godzilla Final Wars came out. It celebrated Godzilla's 50th anniversary, and among the many, many different license items that came out, one of them was this very unique and very fun electronic dartboard. So as you can see, it's loaded with your standard dart-based games, such as Cricket, 301, 501, etc. But it's loaded with a bunch of different unique sounds and features from the Godzilla films itself. Music, Godzilla roars, monster roars. We're fortunate enough to have one here in the office. I just can't say who's the best at it. One of the more unique items that we have here out in the open is this diorama statue from Plex. Limited to 100 copies, it shows Godzilla from 1954 and features sights and sounds and lights and roars and rumbles. It's definitely a conversation starter. Whenever it's on, everyone in the office is turning their heads and wondering what's going on. But it's a centerpiece for us. We'd like to have it out in the open so everyone can see it. So to my left is just a small sampling of some of the Godzilla-related goods we have here in the office. Brands such as Bandai, Playmates, Kid Robot, NECA, BioWorld, you name it, it's probably here. But thanks for letting us show you around. In our next episode, we'll be taking a look at some of the very rare and unique gems from our vault. We'll see you next time when we tackle the beast in the basement. Stay tuned to Toho's official Godzilla YouTube channel for more content, including exclusive items from Japan, episodes of the show, and more. Just hit the subscribe button and you're all set.